Okay, so this is a B-Link S2 uh, that I just recently picked up uh, on Amazon. It was on for a great price. You know, a few months old now, Gemini Lake uh, and 4100 Celeron, 4 gigs of RAM. And what I was assuming was going to be eMMC, it actually came with 128 gig M.2 SATA SSD. So that was a great surprise. Uh, I'll shoot some pictures at this moment. So I got it home, I activated Windows on my guest network, and I promptly erased it, just a whatever, paranoia, <laughs> and a nice fresh clean install of Windows uh, 1809. Uh, and then I promptly went and installed Linux Mint, because that's what this is going to be running. It's going to be running some web apps, uh, going to be running Nextcloud and uh, Resilio, BitTorrent Sync, a few other items. Um, but this is going to be replacing my Raspberry Pi. Uh, I have a 3B plus with external USB hard drive and that became a pain in the butt and I had to have a fan on it. This is fanless. And it's worlds faster now. Yes, it's a few hundred dollars more depending on where you live or sales, but um, fanless, the temperatures are great. A 500 gig uh, regular hard drive, spinning hard drive for now. Um, so I still have Windows, obviously. And this is on the SSD that it came with. Uh, read speeds are good. They're like 500 meg. Writes are just under 300. Okay, so there's Windows. Boots nice and quick. I'm really happy with the performance of this. I was looking at hardware info. Temperatures are fine. It's boosting uh, around 2.3, 2.1 all the time. Um, yeah, really, so boot, uh, Linux Mint, also on the SSD. Again, it's nice and quick. Uh, kernel 4.18 and Mesa 18.3.1 currently. And then I have the 500 gig hard drive as EXT4. Um, and what's really nice is I added Clonezilla, the ISO, into Grub. Um, so whatever I want, because I'm not running, you know, uh, BSRF or whatever it is with, you know, a snapshot file system or anything, when I want to make my major changes, I can boot Clonezilla live off the 500 gig hard drive and back up the SSD, you know, whatever, take 20 minutes and come back and it's completely snapshot and then I can mess around and really break things and don't worry about data loss. But anyways, uh, yeah, really impressed with this little box. I think it's going to work really well. Highly, uh, the Gemini Lake, the next generation Gemini Lake, these are really great little CPUs compared to, you know, Atoms from when Netbooks first came out, the Atom N500 series. Anyways, uh, hope you enjoyed.